consider a rectangle of length of length L and breadth B. We need to find the coordinates of center of mass of this rectangle. For that, let's take the x and y axis that is let's say the x axis passes through the length like this and the y axis through the breadth let's mark this as y axis and this one as x axis now let us consider a thin strip a thin rectangular strip like this let the thickness of the strip be uh, dx and the distance from the y axis be x that is this distance be x we have the formula for the center of mass the coordinate x coordinate of center of mass x cm is equal to x dm integral x dm by integral dm this is the formula how in, this is the formula that which we can find this x coordinate of the center of mass where dm means the mass let rho be the mass per mass per unit area unit area of the rectangle rho be the mass per unit area of the rectangle then we have dm is equal to the mass per unit area into area of this strip but we know the length of the strip is b that is the same as this one and the breadth is dx so dm is equal to rho into area will be length into breadth here it is b into dx clear the strip will be like this here dx is its breadth and this length b is its length so area is equal to b times dx clear now if you substitute that in here x cm is equal to integral x dm you can write rho b dx divided by you know integral dm means the total mass of the rectangular strip that is total mass equal to mass per unit area into total area that is rho into area of the rectangle is equal to lb so integral dm is equal to rho lb rho lb now here the variable is dx clear so this point will be 0 0 since this is the length this point will be 0 to l so the x since x is the variable x x is varying from 0 to l so the limit of the integral is 0 to l clear now you you can take this row and be outside since it is a constant then integral 0 to l x dx divided by rho l b so this will be you can cancel this row and this row also this this b will get cancelled so integral x dx is equal to x square by 2 you have to put the lower limit as 0 and the upper limit as l and in the denominator a l remains so this is equal to l square divided by 2 divided by l or l square by 2l you can cancel this l so it will be l by 2 clear so xcm is equal to so xcm or the x coordinate of center of mass will be l by 2 clear that is if you mark that in here in the diagram it will be somewhere it is at the exact middle of the exact middle of its length clear now you need in the similar way you have to find the ycf or the y coordinate of center of mass for that i am taking a strip like this a horizontal strip like this here 
here also we take a rectangular strip in this case the thickness is dy and the distance from the x axis that is the distance from the x axis is equal to y so the so let's erase all this So we have the formula, the y coordinate of center of mass ycl is equal to integral y dm divided by integral of dm. So here in this case, integral, sorry, dm means area of this small strip. Area of the small strip will be rho times area of uh, mass per unit area into area of the thin strip is equal to mass of this thin strip is equal to rho into dA you know the length is here let's look at the length of the strip length is equal to L right the strip will be like this its breadth is sorry not dx dy and the length is L so its area will be L dy so substituting in here y cm is equal to integral y instead of dm you can write for l dy divided by dm remains the same integral dm integral dm is equal to rho lb rho lb is equal to you can take this rho l outside rho l integral y dy divided by rho lb now you have to put the limit since this coordinate is equal to 0 b, y varies from 0 to b. So 0 to b. So this is equal to, you can cancel this rho l and this rho l. So integral y dy is equal to y square by 2. You have to put the limit 0 to b divided by b. Which is equal to b square by 2b or b by 2. So the y coordinate of the center of mass is equal to b divided by 2 clear so the y coordinate is equal to b by 2 b by 2 combining these two the center of mass comes here that is exact at exact center of the rectangle or the meeting point of the diagonal so the coordinate of the center of mass will be l by 2 comma b by 2 where L and B are the length and breadth of the rectangle. Clear.